We're, we're asked a lot about the impacts of two animals on, uh, on whitetail deer. One is cattle and the other one is wild hogs. What I want to talk about is the cattle end of it. I grew up in the cattle business, so I, I know a lot about, about raising cattle, what's involved in it. But I always say this, cows can be the best friend or the worst enemy whitetail deer have. You can't pay to produce the, the benefits that cattle grazing can do for deer, but you also can't pay to fix the damage they can do if it's improperly done. Now we studied, uh, did a study down in South Texas where we looked at rotation grazing of cattle. And when we had cows in a pasture, the deer moved to the next pasture. When the cows went to that pasture, the deer moved back to the pasture where they had been. They really don't like being around cattle. They tolerate them. And we think the reason is that cows are real big and they make a lot of noise. And deer just don't like that. And also they can be, they can be pretty pushy uh, at a feeder or even on a food plot. So uh, cattle are, we use cattle to manage whitetails. They're important for us in, in range country, but uh, we don't overgraze either.